the new post. As an unhinged Chevy Chase demonstrates in this holiday classic, that's one thing you might do with a Newell post. In fact, Newell posts have a rich and fascinating history. Who knew? Why, Mo Rocca, of course. Staircases. They're more than just a way to get from one floor to the next. A staircase really can be very theatrical. A staircase is a stage. Sam Cochran is Global Features Editor at Architectural Digest. It's an opportunity for ceremony. I think about prom as people descend the steps in their regalia. Of course, like it's in every movie and TV show. Like, Dee Dee, your date is here. Swing, swing. In the 1999 comedy, She's All That, Freddie Prinze Jr. waited for his date, played by Rachel Lee Cook, at the bottom of the stairs. And a staircase played a symbolic role in this Christmas classic starring Jimmy Stewart. There's a famous scene in It's a Wonderful Life where George Bailey ascends the staircase and grabs the newel cap and it comes off, and that is a sign of him being down on his luck. Yes, that thing that George Bailey pulls loose is called a newel cap, sometimes called a newel finial if it's especially ornate. They're everywhere you look. They're outside on the streets, they're in public institutions like libraries and museums. It's largely a decorative element, though it is nice to grab onto. Look how President Teddy Roosevelt manhandles his newel cap in this portrait by John Singer Sargent. Where are we? We are at 150th Street and St. Nicholas Place. And Preservationist Michael Henry Adams took us inside this mansion, currently being restored in Harlem, where we found this dramatic staircase, its handsome newel post, climaxing in a sumptuous, electrified finial. The more you had, the more you knew, the more exposure you'd had to the world. More is more. More is more. This was once the home of James Bailey, of Barnum and Bailey, co-creators of The Greatest Show on Earth. This aesthetic seems apropos for the co-owner of a circus. It definitely was meant to be a show place. It's a miracle the staircase survived. A former owner let her German shepherds roam freely. Did they become feral? For all intents and purposes, I mean, the amount of damage that they did to Ugh. the house was extraordinary. I mean, uh, balusters on the staircase chewed. were chewed right through. Ugh. Good luck chewing through these babies. What year is this house? It was built um, between 1831 and 1832. These urn-shaped finials outside the Merchant's House Museum in Lower Manhattan were once ubiquitous on city streets. Each of these scrolls, you know, was rolled out on a machine and instead of this be, having been a unique element, that there would have been many of these all over downtown New York. Oh. But you might say everything old is Newell again. And then he's going to go a little bit deeper just to get the depth here. Mike Cangelosi yeah, runs JMP Wood, started by his family in 1974 in Brooklyn, where they make Newell caps. If someone comes to you and says, I'm a Newell Post finial virgin, I don't know which to choose. How do you help that person decide? The first question is, you want something comfortable for your hand. A lot of people, they'll just look at it and see it and say, they all look the same to me. So you, you gotta take it for a test drive, which means putting your hand on top Correct. of it. Oh, look at that, get round like that. We watched craftsman Hector Corny at work. That's at least 45, 50 years under his belt. Hector. Bravo. It's really great. I mean, this is, this is so smooth. We don't know who carved this staircase on exhibit at New York's Metropolitan Museum of Art. In America, we are used to grabbing our Newell Post caps and finials on the way out the door. That's not happening at the Metropolitan Museum. <laughs> <laughs> Associate curator Wolf Burchard and conservator Mecca Baumeister led the Met team that recently restored the 1680 Cassioberry Staircase, rescued from an estate just north of London. 
it's a solid piece. You know, like this newel post is cut out of a solid tree. But the staircase's finial is shrouded in mystery. Ultimately, is it a pine cone or a pineapple? Hmm, that's a question. Pineapples are traditionally a symbol of warmth and welcome. Pineapples are a very exotic and prestigious fruit at the time. Um, and I think we have to leave it open at the moment. Log on now and register your vote if it's a pineapple or a pine cone. At this point, I know what you're thinking. Well, I went ahead and asked that very question. We're doing an entire piece on newel post caps and finials. Are we overdoing it? Are we crazy? I don't think you are crazy. One thing is I think beauty has a function in the sense of it's enriching our lives, our experiences. Um, so beauty is very important in life.